Hey guys, this is Hawk. Welcome back to the channel and to Summer in Mara. So at the end of the last episode, I left you guys on a cliffhanger and we are picking up right at the exact same spot where we left off, standing outside the front door. And we are going to go down to the beach to investigate a light that Koa has seen. Let's find out what it is. There's no music. Okay, so there is the light she's talking about. <laughs> oh, what a beautiful light. Little light, come little light. Don't be afraid. Are you lost? Can I help you? Come on, don't be shy. It's gone. I'm sure Nio and Now know something about the light that I saw at night. They see everything from above. Although I should first bring them a food offering. I hope some oranges will be enough. Bring a food offering to the statues of Nio and Now. Will do. Any oranges on you? No. Nothing back here. So it does take the trees. I think they're kind of randomized as to when they grow. But... Any of these berry bushes. The berry bushes are not the greatest things on the planet. They don't give you a whole lot of hunger. And I'm just walking beside them just to see if they bring up a prompt to hit them. Um, where's my music? Ah, here's a tree seed. Any other trees have seeds on them? Because that means I can chop trees down. This game has such cute music. I love it. Alright, I said I was going to plant another tree. Let's go ahead and do it. There we go. Ah, here's another tree seed. Which means I can chop this one down. Anyways, I think the uh, growth of the trees is kind of randomized. So, you know, tomorrow some of those trees might be grown, but the other ones may not grow for another two or three days. I think. It's been a while. Alright, so Neo and Now. I actually forgot to introduce you to Neo and Now the last time we were up here. Meet Neo and Now. I don't know which is which. <laughs> Perfect. I hope you like it. You're not all that talkative, are you? Neo, now, I'm worried. I saw a light in the middle of the sea. I don't know what it means, but it might not be good. I hope you'll keep watch from up here. If you see anything, you know what to do. Although I should light the fire, it hasn't been lit for a long time. Uh... This is weird, but can I just get a... I can. Um. That's it. I'm sure you can see everything better now. It's been a long time since I lit this flame. I got a new structure, a fire. Okay. Let's check to see. None of these respond, so we don't have any of that to do today. What do we have in our inventory? Really nothing to plant. So if I chop down a bunch of trees, I'm not going to be able to replant them right away. Um, hmm. So then what would I like to do today? I guess I could fish. Anybody else got tree seeds? Because I just chopped down a tree I shouldn't have chopped down. 
I mean, I can always replant it tomorrow with whatever tree seeds I find. But let's see here. Do I still have a fishing rod on me or do I have to go remake that because that was in the past? Call myself an octopus. Like I said, I try not to overfish them. Because I don't know how long it takes them to respawn. They seem to be very lacking in respawn rates. So I guess we can fish here. Maybe we can make ourselves some yummy fish. Actually, maybe we can make ourselves some yummy fish. You have to add the question mark at the end of it because it's, uh, we're not really quite sure if it's actually yummy fish. I mean, I know whether it is or not. If you've played the game, you know whether it is or not. For those of you that haven't, you don't know yet. Let's go fish down here. Whatever these flat fish things were. Oh, I just remembered I have to... I believe I need to water the plants. Oh, it, it literally is a flat fish. Sure, let's go one more time on this one. There we go. Yeah, I don't see any more tree seeds. So like I said, I can continue chopping down some trees. I'll just have to make sure I replant them. And I don't believe that there's anything negative that occurs. Yaya told you that you're supposed to make sure to give back to the land. I don't think anything negative actually occurs if you don't replant them, but you lose your source of wood if you don't. I forgot to water the carrots. There we go. Now, I think... There we go. That'll at least get that fence out of the way so when we go to water things that we don't get stopped by the fence. Okay, anything else that we can do? No tools. I mean, I can make another bucket. This I need thread. I can't even make thread, I don't think. Oh, wow, I could actually make grilled fish with the prawn I've got left. Oh, I don't have enough carrots to make the yummy fish. Remember, question mark on the end, yummy fish. We'll make that just in case we need it. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else for me to do today. We have done all of the work. Um, so as weird as it sounds, um, and I don't want to keep chopping down trees because of the fact that I don't have tree seeds. And if I cut too many down, I don't know how long it's going to take me to get the tree seeds uh, to be able to replant them. So let's go to bed for the day. Can I open this, by the way? Mm. I'm going to need something to open the chest. Okay, I cannot. Uh, let's go to sleep. Hmm. There's the light again. It seems to be closer. I will take a look. Return to the beach to figure out the source of the light.
Um. Oh, in the water again. Okay. Little light, little light. Come, please. I want to help you. I'm sure you're lost. Nobody else has come close to this island. Little light. Wow, what a whimsical light. Well, I better go to sleep. By the way, I do wish I was better at doing, like, voices. I could do a couple accents, but I really can't do voices. Okay, so I guess let's start by watering the carrots. Just so we don't forget again. They've got... Oh, they're done. Does this have any water left in it? Yeah, it's got one. Okay. We're going to have to obviously rewater these because they are no longer watered. There we go. Oh, look, that was the one I planted a couple days ago. Uh, tree seeds, tree seeds, tree seeds. You have no oranges. Okay, yes, here's the ones I planted. They're just tiny little shrubberies. Do you have... I need boards and nails before I can fix the chicken coop. No oranges for you? Oh, here's a tree seed. Hey, you've got an orange. Well, these grew in pretty fast, all things considered. By the way, there's the little light down there. We will get to him in just a minute. I want to check all my trees. Just like I said, this is why I like to have all of this stuff. Uh, you know what? We'll hit this, but we're going to chop it down. Because I would rather... See, these count towards the, um, the tree count on the island. And I would rather have orange trees than berry bushes. So we will be planting some more either orange trees or... Ooh, two oranges. Very nice. Okay, so any other tree seeds? Yaya used to say this is a stable for sheep, but I've never seen one. You can see it has a little sheep icon on it. Don't worry, we will get there, Koa. Okay, so we have two pine nuts. And we can still plant three trees. Um, I think that might have to wait because I'm running out of things to make. Well, I've got a blackberry juice. I can make another one because they took three blackberries. I could plant the rest of the oranges. Right now, let's go down and talk to you, this little light. Who's in the middle of the water. Hello, were you yesterday's little light? Are you lost? The little light's name is Napopo. I love it, it's so cute. Uh, maybe you don't understand me? Are you alone? Are you hungry? Hmm. Of course. 
Don't worry, I'll bring you some delicious juice. Don't starve to death, please. I'll be right back. Orange juice. Of course, it'd be the one juice I don't have on me. I guess I will not be planting those oranges for tree seeds. Uh, sorry, not tree seeds. For more orange trees. So let's go ahead and make another blackberry juice right away then. So I've got that. And sure, let's make a yummy fish. And head back to Napopo. There you go. I hope it's not too acidic. Yaya used to add some sugar cubes, but I ran out of those. Do you need anything else? Aha! Uh -huh. It's little squeal is so cute. Can't you speak? Come on, try it. Say koa. I am koa. Maybe you don't understand me. <laughs> you do understand me. That's good. We have to find a way to communicate. I know. You could draw. Do you know how to draw? Smile if you do. Very smiley. I'm sure my wax crayons are somewhere on the island. Maybe they're inside Yaya's chest. I know I shouldn't rummage around in there. However, this is an emergency. Find some crayons. Whoops. I fell in the water. Let's get some crayons. A lot of my paintings are in here. And old stuff. Here are some of Yaya's notes. An address and a name are written down. Sammy, the light or lighthouse of Chalice. I don't actually know how they intended for that the name of this island to be pronounced. I'm going to pronounce it as Chalice. I don't know who this is. There are more names, but they're crossed out. Bah, whatever. Let's see. Ah, here are the crayons. Now I have to make a board to draw on. Maybe with a plank of wood. Hey, new recipe. Let's get a board. Board. Check. And to Napopo we go. I don't think I can make that jump. I didn't think so. I think you gotta go sort of around the back. Hey, more herbs. There we go. Okay, now we have everything ready. Great. Now, let's see. I have so many questions that I don't know where to start. Okay, do you like chocolate? Of course, let's start with the important ones. Clearly he does. Okay, that's good. Are you lost? And now sad face, so yes. Oh, that's sad. Do you know how to get back home? Meaning you know how to get back, but you can't? Sad face again. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Why can't you go back? Did somebody hurt you? Angry face. I'm sure we can figure it out. Or you can stay here and live with me. I don't have chocolate, but I do have all the orange juice you could want. Sad face again. So sad. Oh, don't you want to stay? What do you want to do? Boat. Oh, I would like the boat to be functioning too. I can't take you uh, with the boat. It doesn't work. I can't get off the island. I could fix the boat, but there's no fuel. The fountain is dry. I'm not quite sure what that face is, but let's go with, um, he just had an epiphany. And now he's happy. You? You can do something about the fountain? Happy again. Let's go check it. By the way, what's your name? <laughs> and then he shows a picture of his face. Of course, your name is Napopo. Naturally, I would get that from that drawing too. <laughs> Okay, go to the fountain. I'll go for the deposit. It should be on the boat. So we need the tank. Uh, tank. 
Oh, okay. I thought I was just going to open that. I guess instead we're just going to chop that box right apart. And he just mysteriously vanishes. Sneaky little guy. Okay. <laughs> wow, that was pretty. Napopo, who are you? A nice picture of a tree. And something that looks like him except is gray instead of pink. And then there's him. And then sad him. And then angry face. Oh, I'm so sorry. That means people hurt your family. We will find them, and they'll see. I'm going to fix the boat, and we'll go find them. First, make new oars. Then patch up the holes. And last, decorate the deck. Napopo, what do you think? He's very excited. Let's go get wood. Fix Yaya Haku's boat is our current mission. I filled the tank. Okay. I have no idea how much wood I need to be able to make things like ores. Um, I have honestly have no idea how much is on me either. I keep forgetting how to... Oh, there we go. Tab through these things. I got 19 wood. Your inventory is unlimited, by the way. Okay, tools. No recipes. Workshop. Okay, I need a board. I'm assuming I need two oars. But let's check. Uh, it just says fix Yaya Haku's boat. Okay, maybe I'd go fix it first. I mean, she said she needed um, boards to be able to patch the holes. But let's see. Build. Yeah, I need one more ore. Unless you're in a canoe, most boats require at least two. Alright, so I would need another board. And another ore. Now the question is... Do I have enough wood left after all of that to be able to fix the boat? Or do I have to get more trees? Oh, nope, we're good. Hmm. Everything is ready to set sail. Napopo, are you ready? Hmm. He's definitely ready. But first, I have to check if all the field crops have been watered and pick up the seashells on the western beach. I think I should plant new trees as well. I'm not sure if Neo and now have enough food, and I have to check that every seagull is comfortable in their nest. Oh, he's not happy. What's wrong? This island needs a lot of attention. What if I leave and something happens to me? I don't know, Napopo. I'm a bit scared. Oh, so cute. I know that, since I'm with you. But do you know the place we're heading to? Chalice? I don't know who this Sammy is. The one Yaya used to write to. What are we going to do out there? I don't think that Yaya Haku would have let me go. Okay, okay. Guide me. I will follow your instructions. But we have to return to my island and take care of it from time to time. Look at my little backpack I just got. Sail north and you'll arrive at Chalice Island. My little purple backpack I have. All right, so we have to fix the pier. I need eight boards to fix the pier. Do I actually need to fix the pier? I mean, I would like to fix the pier. But for some reason, I think I don't actually need it. Yeah, I really don't. I mean, I would like to at some point. You know what? Let's go ahead. And you can see little Napopo's uh, just 
we are going north, right? So we're sort of going, there we go. You can see the map in the bottom corner. Napopo is standing like uh, Jack and Rose on the front of the boat. There's a really big stingray. You've discovered a new place in Mora. We are at Chalice. <laughs> Napopo, you have a very good sense of direction. Could you guide me forever? You are the best. Now maybe we could ask those yayas over there. Oh, look, more bait. Garbage. Hello? <laughs> wow! You are Yaya's. Mm -hmm. What are you talking about, kid? <laughs> I am no hope, and this is Caleb. We know no Yaya. <laughs> yes, you are. You're like my grandma. Your grandma is a Quido, but my grandma is Yaya Haku. I know no Quido. We are Quido. Am I Quido? Um, that's a good question. <laughs> you see, some years ago I met a teen girl like you. She was young and strong. She liked to swim very much. She swam through two seas. It was further than the storm belt, of course, where the sea is no longer called Mara. The thing is, the two seas were connected by a great coral reef. It was said that squid quidos lived there. Half quido, half squid. They didn't have legs, only tentacles. Are you lost? A bit. This is Chalice, right? I am looking for a woman. Sammy, I think she lives in the lighthouse. The tide started to rise and the undertow was terrible. The girl couldn't get out of the water. Then she noticed something was dragging her foot. Yeah, she's the lady of the lighthouse. This is a constant thing with these two. It's really funny. Caleb keeps talking over top of Noho because he rambles nonstop. It's pretty hysterical. At last, she made it to the shore. Barely made it, but she had a she had tentacle marks all over her leg, and the sea was calm. So if you were born on Chu, you are Quido. I guess I probably should pronounce those differently if uh <laughs> Although you don't look like one. That's good to know. Thank you. I'll head to the lighthouse and ask. Now I can open a map. There's gotta be a way to do that from All right, let's go in here. I don't know exactly how to open the map yet. We'll figure it out. It's closed. Opens between 10 and 1600. Okay, let's go explore. These, by the way, uh, we will get this information shortly, but these are male crabs. And these are actually, look, Ganon and Luna Buna, you made it in the game, meow. These are actually uh, notes that were submitted uh, by Kickstarter backers of Summer and Mara. So my perfect kitties love mommy blush wolf. So and but you do actually get whoa. Why are you chasing me? Stop it. Um, so you do actually get some items from the crabs when you read the notes. So it's always worth reading. I don't know what it was I just got. I got milk. Okay, let's go talk to this guy whose name I can't remember. Um, Hi, I'm Koa. Maybe you can help me with something? Um, right, his name is Brom. Er, burr. Hello, I'm Brom. Yeah. Are you okay? Oh. No. It's just burr. I think I messed up. With what? <laughs> My uncle is opening his establishment soon, and we need supplies. So I ordered some corn at the market, but burr. They only brought me corn seeds. It's a disaster. The corn comes from the corn seeds, so I don't see a problem here. Well, I don't have any place to plant them. If you give them to me, I'll bring you the corn. For, for real? Of course. That would be awesome. My uncle Taka is nice, but he's also strict. I don't know how he would react. Thank you very much, Burr. You're welcome, Burr. Nice, some seeds I don't have to buy. 
Okay. We are running out of energy, as a matter of fact. Hello, people. Uh, here's another male crab. I hope that one day I'll reminisce and remember this game as being one of the best experiences of my life. I grew up loving a few games, and I haven't felt that same feeling in a while. I have big hopes. Well, I'm not going to pretend I can pronounce it. I got a lollipop. You probably can't sunbathe anymore. It's getting dark. Alright, here's another dock. Here's some more bait. What can we catch here? Uh, I don't know what this is. A bass. There we go. I see a seashell over here. Okay. Look at how pretty Mara is. Well, technically, this is Chalice. Hi, Poochie. <laughs> I was pretty sure I could harvest this. Some more garbage. You can actually recycle the garbage. Um, I don't remember if you get anything for it. I don't have apples to feed you. I'm very sorry. This guy, he's great. He's got his own music. Every time you talk to him. <laughs> it's very adventurous. There's no time to waste. His name is Anzo, by the way. There's no time to waste. And he sells things. Um, pumpkin seeds. I don't have any money. So unless I sell something... How do I sell? Maybe I can't sell to him? Can I sell to you? Oh, there we go. That's what I have in my inventory. Uh... I don't want to sell thread. I don't want to sell my food. Yeah, I really don't want to sell these fish either because I'm not sure if I need them for anything. I have this funny feeling there were some things that I sold at one point and then I had to go back looking for them at a later time. Uh, you know what? Let's go... If I am not much mistaken. First of all, Koa's getting tired. I'm going the wrong way. These vending machines actually sell things. Uh, I can't even see what's in them, apparently. I think... Yeah, there's some stuff down here I can grab, too. Oh, I can't break that open. All right, we are going to go ahead and sail back. Because uh, the one thing is, is you can actually sleep on the boat. You don't sleep as well. Um, Uh-oh. I forgot that happened, though. Ooh, yeah, look at my... My energy is barely restored. It's kind of garbage. Uh, put me here. Okay. Well... Let's see. That's really... Sure. There we go. That's much better. Okay. So we need to go... I do need to buy some seeds. 
So I need to figure out what I can sell here. What do you buy again? She buys metal. Coal, potatoes. What do you buy? These are all sisters, by the way. I don't know if they pay the same price. I'm assuming they probably do. Let's go over to this lady on the other side. Those two in the front and this lady in the back. They are sisters. Uh, let's sell you. Okay. So, yeah, you can see here that she is going to pay a better price for... She's a produce lady. Um, so she's going to pay a better price for carrots, lettuce, and potatoes. And then the other lady up front, she was going to pay a better price for this bass that I had. So let's go ahead and sell... Did I sell it? Okay, let's do that so we still have some others left over. And then let's buy some seeds. Okay, so that's 28. Okay, that's about all the money I have right there. We'll buy those. The song that's playing now, by the way, is the one that I had mentioned previously that started cutting out. Chai Big seems to use this in a lot of their promotional material. It's a gorgeous song. So there is, I think there's a spot down here where we can get some shells and some trash. Oh, male crab. I've stolen myself from the world and I'm waiting for sweet love. Grab this. And then let's go up here. I don't know if we can get into this house yet. Look at the little blue squirrel. He's so cute. Bye. No solicitors, no intruders. That's rude. See, there's an enormous hand up there. We can't get in there yet. You can see that's closed off still. Okay, lighthouse is up this way. And this place always has... I don't know if I can... So I can't mine the white ones. I don't think I can mine these yellow ones either. Yeah, just the blue and orange right now. I think the blue is iron and the orange is copper. There's a better view of that enormous hand. starting to run out of energy again. So this is where we're going. This is the lighthouse. But she sometimes has 
She does not come out and pick her oranges all the time. I got a B. I don't remember what significance that has. Ooh, apples. There's also flowers. Oh, but I need to hoe for it. Okay. Hey, hey! Is Sammy here? Who are you? I want to talk to Sammy. Where are your manners? Don't bother me if it's nothing important. Well, looks like it's not going to work. What if I ask the Quidos at the harbor? We will go down the back way, because I think... Wait, that's not the back way. That's the front way. I think there are more resources back here as well. I don't remember what, but... Ah, berries. Gonna need to eat my yummy fish soon. Here, let's just drink some blackberry juice, maybe. I need to have things to sell so I can get some more money. Oh, cherries. I thought there were more apples. So I don't know if you notice when I'm mining, uh, you a lot of times, so that was copper, then there was stone, and then more stone. Um, so you got, kind of get a chance of a... Uh... You get a chance of getting like the ores. So that was iron, stone, iron. I don't remember, I don't know specifically what the percentages are that, what the chance percentage is that you get the ores versus just stone, but... Ooh, fruit. I will definitely take more food. And more food. Okay, so where are these ladies? Uh, where am I? There we go. I th think... Wait. Here's more trash. Um, I need to get back to the kind of town square. Oh, here we go. I think one of these ladies pays a better price for stone, and I could get rid of some of it. Okay, so she likes to buy fish. I don't want to sell fish to you. Okay, I guess not. I do have quite a bit of stone. Um... No, I think I'll hang on to my stuff right now. We are going to sail back to the island so that we can check on the plants. But also because, like I said, you get a better night's sleep. Oh, is this place open? Wow, they're really not open very frequently. Oh, I was supposed to talk to these guys. Uh, is it you I talked to? Hello. Nope. What do you sell? Carrot seeds and lettuce seeds and cotton seeds. Uh, I guess I could probably do these at the same time. I want to take some cotton along. 
There we go. Hello again. Hey, the lady doesn't want to talk to me. That's because you can't go around with manners like those. I once met a man who was a butler. He lived in a huge house. He took good care of his master. It's not that I agree with those kinds of things, but he found a yum-yum in the dining room of the house. Thing is, he didn't scream and he didn't become unsettled. He just dealt with the situation. Do you know how? No. Me neither. That's his secret. He didn't want to tell me. So what do I do? Go and ask, kid. Okay. Hey, do you know anything about a lady called Sammy? I'm sorry, we are merchants. If you don't give us something in exchange, our mouths are sealed. Well, not completely. That's true. Because I once met a couple along the shores of Arestia that... Okay, I get it. Look, I need some thread. Take some cotton seeds. I'll tell you how to obtain it after you harvest it. Bring me thread and we'll be able to tell you something else. I think I just bought cotton seeds. Really? Do I have thread? I have thread. That requires dragonflies. Here it is. You're not going to find better thread anywhere on the island. We get on well, child. Now you're ready for the grand revelation. What? The woman you're looking for is in the lighthouse. Caleb already told me that. Well, that's it. Anything else? Nothing. That's all. Isn't it enough? But take this for the inconvenience. Thank you, old man. Who you calling old? Me? Caleb is not old. He is an experienced Quido. And now what? You can ask the people in the city about the woman of the lighthouse. They might know how to make her open the door. Oh. A novel and a mollusk shell. Uh, that took both of my thread. Can I fish now? Alright. I think... Oh, right, you can see it on the map. There's a fishing spot. We'll get that some other time, though. This is, uh... This is the cat guy. It's his music. By the way, you see at the bottom uh, left, it says back to Chalice. That's if you would get stranded if you run out of fuel. It gives you the option of uh, getting towed back. I don't remember what the cost is for that, but... Okay, oranges. What was that? I thought I saw a pop-up. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm dreaming. Any tree seeds? I see a tree seed over here. I think you do run out of stamina faster if you sprint. more tree seeds. I don't immediately see any. Hey, that's got an orange on it, apparently. Alright, guys. Well, I'm going to check these last couple oranges here. Uh, but we are actually going to call this... Ooh, we better get back to the house before she, like, passes out. Because I don't want to be short on energy again tomorrow. Okay, now we've got some energy to finish kind of our inspection of the trees. Hey, there's some tree seeds. I also need to check and see if these, um, since I've got some energy, did these things... Hey, there we go.
Okay. We are just about out of energy again. Also, we've got 60 stone. I do believe that caps out at like 99. So it is in your best interest to sell that. Irks me to kind of sell it uh, while it's... If I don't have somebody that gives me a good price, but we might end up having to do so rather than lose the materials because that's what happens is uh, you'll continue. It'll look like you're collecting the stone, but the count doesn't actually go up. So... All right, we are actually going to go ahead and call this an episode here. I'm going to plant one more orange tree. Uh, because we can support one more plant on the island. And then we are going to go to bed before Koa passes out. Also, I cannot water these things because I don't have any more water in the well until it rains. So we will take care of that in another episode. But I'm going to go ahead and call this here. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, feel free to like and comment. Also subscribe so that you get notified of future videos. But for now, my name is Hawk, and this has been Summer and Mara, and I will catch you guys next time.